More than 300 top prospects continued their quest to achieve their NFL dreams at this year's NFL Scouting Combine. The Combine gives these players the opportunity to prove themselves worthy of a top draft pick in the NFL. A lot is riding on their performance as it can make or break their draft stock. We sat down with Matt Chernoff from 680 The Fans, Chuck and Chernoff Show, who believes the Combine is a chance for the NFL teams to get to know players they may draft. I would think the best, uh, the best way to describe it is they get a chance to know these kids. They get to work them out. They get to interview them. It's a getting to know you before you take a chance in drafting a kid and spending all that money on them. Minnesota Vikings fullback Jerome Felton gave us a firsthand account of what it's like as a player to participate in the Combine. I was invited to the Combine in 2008. Coming out of a small school like Furman University was a big deal for me because I knew a lot of teams didn't watch me play week in and week out. So when you go to the Combine, it's a chance to you know have a performance for all 32 teams, all the general managers there, all the head coaches there, the position coaches, the scouts. So it's important for guys like me that are from smaller schools to be able to go somewhere where all 32 teams are represented. When asked about the marquee event at the Combine, Matt had this to say. Yeah, when they take their clothes off and they're standing in their underwear. I think that's very important. Now, uh, the 40-yard dash, I think a 40 is as important as anything to show the speed you have to have. Felton, a former participant in the 40-yard dash, agreed. 40-yard dash is obviously the marquee event of the combine. It's what you hear about all on ESPN, NFL Network. That's one of the things the guys are really working hard the whole the, the, the weeks leading up to the combine. It's just making sure they're going to run as fast as they can. Um, when I, when I went up there, it was kind of surreal because you're looking up in the stands, you see all of the head coaches, the guys you see on TV, they're all sitting there with their stopwatches at the end of the 40-yard dash, and, you know, it's exciting, though. The road to primetime continues. Tune in April 25th through the 27th for a chance to see how the NFL Combine affected the players' draft stock in this year's NFL Draft.